लड़के देखो कितने हरामी होते हैं ठीक है इनको पता होता है चीते कैसे ठीक है लड़कों को पता होता चलो छोड़ो मैं मैं क्या लगता है अभी भी चीखना चाहती है लड़कियां लड़कियां अभी भी चीखना चाहती है अच्छा हाउ मेनी पीपल आर बीन टू लॉग एट मेक्स भाई सही है तुम्हारा अच्छा हाउ मेनी पीपल स्टे एट लॉग एट मेक्स नॉइस अच्छा हाथ खड़े करने एक बार लॉग एट वाले ओ भाई साहब तुम में से कितने फर्स्ट ईयर वाले हैं वो हाथ खड़े करना लॉग एट में जो रहते हैं अब तुम में से सेकंड ईयर वाले कितने हैं जो लॉग एट में रहते हैं सही है भाई एक साल में ही चार ढाल बदल गई तुम्हारी सही है अच्छा अच्छा आ, अच्छा आ, कोई बताएगा मेरे को कि लॉग एट में मैं खुद वहीं पे रहता हूं तो नहीं 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 नहीं, नहीं। मैं बहुत शरीफ हूं नहीं मैं जेनविनली जेनविनली मैं बहुत शरीफ लड़का हूं मैं कोई गलत काम नहीं करता सुन लिया ना सबने मैं कोई गलत काम नहीं करता ठीक है ना हाँ मैं कोई अच्छा काम भी नहीं करता <laughs> नहीं बट यहां पे थर्ड ईयर वाले कितने हैं थर्ड ईयर स्टूडेंट सेकेंड ईयर स्टूडेंट्स डाउन 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 फर्स्ट ईयर स्टूडेंट्स इट्स काइंड ऑफ इक्वल नॉट रियली बट लेट्स डू इट दैट वे आ रहे एक बार स्टेज पे आना जल्दी आ जल्दी आ रहे सच देखो को कितने लोग यहां पे जानते हैं मेक्सम नॉइस क्या बात है आर्यन फैन फॉलोइंग अच्छा तो आर्यन माइक ऑन कर वहां से तो आर्यन ये वाली टीम तेरी है लेफ्ट साइड वाली राइट साइड वाली टीम है मेरी ठीक है यू ऑन द लेफ्ट बिकॉज आई एम ऑलवेज राइट बट तो दोनों माइक ऑन कर ले और ज्यादा जोर से मत चीखना कहीं <laughs> कहीं <laughs> भैया मैं कपड़े चेंज करके आया ठीक <laughs> है तो आर्यन योर टीम एंड दिस इज माय टीम फ्रॉम हेयर ऑन ठीक है चल हाँ। तू एक बार करवा वोट नहीं पहले आप नहीं पहले आप पहले आप नहीं पहले पहले आप, आप।, पहले आप। बड़े लोग पहले नहीं 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 लेडीज फर्स्ट फैकल्टीज फर्स्ट <laughs> चलो अब हम नया बना देंगे ट्रांसजेंडर्स बस कोई नहीं आई आई रिस्पेक्ट चल तो सही चल तो सही करवा तो सही अपनी टीम को हूट नहीं मैं सेकंड जाऊंगा ठीक है मैं कराता हूं फिर ठीक है आई वाइज वही आई सेड आर यू वेरी फिर मैं नीचे आके करवाता हूं ठीक है यहां पे कराते हैं हूट और राइट आर्यन आर यू रेडी यस और राइट टीम आर यू रेडी I said, are you ready? And now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, brothers and girls of lovely professional university, are you ready? The next one. देखो, अब है इज्जत की बात, ठीक है? तो हाथ जोड़ के विनती है, चीख देना। देखो, इसके इसके यही काम है भिकारियों वाले हाथ जोड़ के कटोरा लेके। चीख देना बस, ठीक है? और अगर कोई टीम ए से भी मेरी हेल्प करना चाहे तो आप कर सकते हो बिल्कुल बस हुटिंग करवानी है ना नहीं 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 राइट सिर्फ हुटिंग करवानी है ठीक है देख लो देश की भी बात है ठीक है तुम लोग बू करना बू वन टू देखते हैं कितने लोग बू करते हैं आई चैलेंज यू ठीक है भारत माता की यार एक सेकेंड दिस इज अनफेयर ये अनफेयर है ये तो इमोशनल टाइम लाइन पर जाके करवा लो ये चीटिंग है नहीं 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 ये चीटिंग होगी अच्छा एक सेकंड इसे इसने कराया ना भारत माता की जय पे हूट अब मैं करवाता हूँ ठीक है अब मैं हूट करवाता हूँ आज तक आया उस त्रि सारे चल आएंगे भारत माता की जय फिर देख लेना भारत माता की भारत माता की बात तो वही आ गई भारत माता की यार यार ये गलत है तू अपनी टीम को हूट करा ना तू करा टीम वन मेक सम नॉइस तो हम माने ठीक है चलो 
रेडी हो ना ये ना ये ना टिपिकल इंडियन पॉलिटिक्स खेल रहे हैं यहाँ पे लोगों की ना दुखती रखो पे हाथ रख के चिल्ला दे दिस इज इंडियन पॉलिटिक्स एवरीथिंग इज फेयर इन लव एंड वॉर दिस इज नॉट लव और वॉर इधर नहीं नहीं ऐसी बात है कि आर्यन बस रात को मेरे साथ कल चलो आर्यन हूट करवाओ और राइट टीम टू टीम वन है टीम टू है टीम टू बोला था ना स्टार्टिंग में यार आप भूल रहे हो क्या बात है घबरा के इतनी जल्दी भारत माता की जय बुलवाया घबरा गया तू करवा और राइट टीम टू लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन बॉयज एंड गर्ल्स सोन यार अब ना जोर से सीखना है ठीक है आर यू गाइस क्लियर ठीक है मैं इतनी एनर्जी डाल के जब यहां पे चीख रहा हूं तो तुम लोग भी चीखो सारे वहां तक पीछे तक जितने भी बैठे हुए लॉन्डे लपाटे और लड़कियां लॉन्डे लपाटे लड़कियां ऐसे बोल रहे हैं मत चीखना यार मैं लेडीज एंड जेंट मेरा प्यार है भाई मेरा प्यार है मैं इनसे प्यार करता हूँ प्यार जेनुअनली ये लोग समझते हैं मैं इनसे प्यार करता हूँ तेरी तरह थोड़ी हूं मैं ठीक है यहां से टीम है गाइस गर्ल्स बी रेडी आप तुम्हें अपनी सीजीपी की कसम अब देख तू अब देख सीजीपी की कसम दे दी तुम सबको सीजीपी की कसम जिसने चीखना चीखो अरे कुछ नहीं नहीं आई ना उतनी आवाज लो यार यार तुम लोग चीख रहे हो कि नहीं चीख रहे हो चीख रहे कहते नहीं तुम लोग नहीं चीख रहे क्या चीख रहे सारे बोल रहे हैं नहीं आपको कैसे हाँ सुन रहे हैं मेरे को सुन रहा है नहीं 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 एक बार फिर करा देखो ये ये इधर से जो ये पिलर है ना उसके इधर वाले सारे अपने लोग हैं हाँ तो ऐसे करना वहां से अपने लोग ले लो फिर मेरे सारे अपने हैं आप बांट रहे हो मैं मैं तो बांट नहीं रहा नहीं बांट नहीं रहा ये वार यार ये यहां पर ना बहुत गंदी पॉलिटिक्स खेल रहा है मैं तुम बता रहा हूं ये बहुत गंदी पॉलिटिक्स खेल रहा है अच्छा एक सेकंड अच्छा सारे तेरे अपने हैं ना सारे तेरे अपने तो चल एक साउथ इंडिया में एक डायलॉग बोल दे बोलेगा अब साउथ इंडिया गुला गुला वो भी गलत है वो भी गलत है मेरे को देख डायलॉग्स क्या क्या आते रहे पुष्प राय और सुन और सुनो अब साउथ इंडियंस आर यू रेडी टू हूट ही सेम दैट यू डोंट हैव दैट मच एनर्जी इन योर सेल्फ साउथ इंडियंस आर यू वेरी हूट नहीं यार हो गया आपसे साउथ इंडियन जय जय देखो नॉर्थ इंडियंस के ना बॉलीवुड वाले डायलॉग ऐसे होते नहीं है वहां पे चलता है एक चुटकी सिंदूर की कीमत तुम क्या जानो रमेश बाबू चल देखो अच्छा कितने लोग चाहते हैं कि आ रहे डायलॉग यहाँ स्टेज पे आके बीच में करें आ जा जा एक चुटकी सिंदूर की कीमत तुम क्या जानो नहीं साहब बाबू नील यार एक तो मैं अपनी लाइफ में पहली बार पजामे में होस्ट कर रहा हूं मुझे पता भी नहीं था कि मैं होस्ट करने वाला हूं बोलो बोलो आज दिन है तुम्हारा भरी हुई ऑडियंस शांति देवी मित्तल ऑडिटोरियम ये सपना था एंड आई गेस मजा आ गया आज देख के थैंक यू सो मच एवरीवन फॉर मेकिंग दिस मोमेंट स्पेशल फॉर एवरी फॉर कमिंग बैक टू कैंपस एंड Making it special for everyone sitting in front of me. So dialogue. एक चुटकी सिंदूर की कीमत तुम क्या जानो साहस बाबू नहीं सेम सेम गोज फॉर साहस भैया मैं तो तेलुगु में डायलॉग बोलूंगा तेलुगु में हाउ मेनी तेलुगु पीपल डू यू हैव मेक सम नॉइस सो द तेलुगु डायलॉग गो समथिंग लाइक ई बाहुबली गुरु जी बहे पड़ता यार एक चीज ऑल दी तेलुगु पीपल प्लीज डू लेट मी नो कि मेरी बेस्ती तो नहीं की ना ये ये कंफर्मेशन इज वेरी नेसेसरी और बॉयज एंड गर्ल्स कैन बी हैव ह्यूज ऑफ अप्लॉज फॉर डायरेक्टर स्पोर्ट्स लवली प्रोफेशनल यूनिवर्सिटी डॉक्टर वी कॉल्सो लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन प्लीज गिव अज ऑफ अप्लॉज फॉर हिम
All right, uh, perfect. Indeed, a very wonderful day in Shantideh Mithila Auditorium, and uh, certainly, I guess a lot of people have been enjoying it. And uh, thank you so very much to Aryan as well for coming over here. Or Nare uh, lagwane ke liye. We are really very proud about that. But uh, people, despite everything, despite you know. Uh, North India, South India, East India, West India, even Central India. We all people are one. We all people are from lovely professional university, and probably that's the best part about LPU. Uh, you know, Aryan himself is from Rajasthan. Uh, my friends, I have a lot of Telugu friends. That's why I've been learning these dialogues. Jammu friends, even you know, African friends in this university. So that's the best part, right? You come to this university, you meet new friends, and you meet new people. And lecture khatam ho gaya. Main lecture zada nahi dunga. <laughs> but uh, uh, at what time are we supposed to event? All right. So we are supposed to start the event in exactly 10 minutes when the Honorable Vardhi Pro Chancellor, lovely professional university, Madam Rashmi Mittal, who is the chief guest of the day, comes over here. She should feel the energy, and I would request you all to kindly give her the loudest possible round of applause. And I would request you all to stand and then give her the loudest possible round of applause. So we are pretty much set to go with the event. Koi uh, coordinator hai yahan pe? Do we have a coordinator somewhere over here? Any coordinator? Koi uh, coordinator hai, the dice ke paas aega. Can you please come over here? Yes, any, yes, any. How many people have already attended the induction? Make some noise! Guys, what happened to your energy? Let's play a little bit of music. Let's play their energy up on the top. Let's play music. Are there any musical demands? One second, one second. One second, one second. Are there any musical demands for you guys? क्या मेरे को कुछ नहीं सुन रहा है जो चलाना चलाओ नहीं 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 पहले मैं एक गाना चलवाने वाला था कोई भी नहीं चलवाऊंगा एपी डिल्लो हम नहीं एपी डिल्लो फैंस लोग यहाँ पर हैं मेरे सामने ठीक है एपी डिल्लो फैंस हैं हमारे पास लेकिन एपी डिल्लो अभी यहाँ पे चल नहीं सकता because ये गेमिंग � Mr. Ravinder in the technical team, ki please koi gana play kare. Get no words. I can't.
I would request the teams of LPU Tigers and MU Sharks Blue to kindly come on the stage for your preparations. So, their teams kindly stage for your preparations. Ladies and gentlemen, a huge round of applause for them, please. All right. And uh, now moving forward. Stalin, do we have more time? All right. Mera na itne andhere mein man kar raha hu flashlight wali activity karaye. Karvaye? Karvaye? Do you want me to do the flashlight activity? I think the dignitaries are already over here and when they come inside, ladies and gentlemen, you know what you have to do. And don't light the off the light, please, these kids are a little bit. They are good. These kids are log-8. Alright, uh, everyone, Stalin has been saying that people love Valorant more. Is that true? Valorant lovers, make some noise! BGMI lovers, make some noise! Who wants Stalin? I guess today, I guess here, more that I am seeing or I have heard of is BGMI. BGMI, right? Right. The stage is set though, however, for Valorant here, but BGMI की जो टीम है, जो आवाज़ है, बहुत ही ज़्यादा बढ़िया है यहाँ पे। And how many cricket lovers do we have over here? Make some noise! I think certainly we do have a lot of cricket lovers over here. Now देख लेते हैं कि how many people love Sachin Tendulkar? Make some noise! All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I request you all to kindly give the loudest possible round of applause for our chief guest of the day, Madam Rashmi Mittal. Worthy Pro Chancellor, lovely professional university. A loud and loud of applause for her, everyone, please. I would even like to welcome our professor and senior dean, head student, welfare wing, lovely professional university, Dr. Saurabh Lakhanpal, sir, and our associate director, Department of Sto Sports, lovely professional university, Dr. V. Call. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, coordinators, all the people who have been making this event possible, ESI as the sponsors and lovely professional university as venue partners. I would love to thank all of you and I would love to welcome all of you over here in Shantide Mitla Auditorium. What could have been a better day for such a wonderful event, which is a national eSports championship, which is certainly the biggest one in India. And the crowd is extremely jammed. The crowd is extremely packed over here. 
but uh, certainly we would love to get the energy we would love to know that are you people ready for this particular e-sports championship and as our chief guest of the day has come over here our pro chancellor lovely professional university madam rashmi mittal even she should feel the energy that she has come over here in e-sports championship all right uh, can we please increase the volume of this particular mic hello mic check all right lovely professional university now for the final time our chief guest ma'am has come over here now from left to right top to bottom all the students of no matter where you come from no matter what ethnicity you're coming from you have to make the loudest possible noise for esports for the games esi and everyone who has come over here to make this event possible are we clear i said are we clear this is not how it's done theek hai zor se bolo are we clear all right now the students on that side as well you have been really very quiet Lovely professional university, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to make some noise? No, 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 that's not how it's done. You haven't been making the loudest possible round of applause and the noise as well. Now for the final time, get your energies up, guys. You have been coming to this university after two years, two long years, and now when we ask you to shout, who do whatever you want to do, you're not doing that. Left side, are you ready? I say left side, are you ready? Middle, are you ready? And now on the right, are you ready? And now let me professional university for the final time. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, are you ready to make some noise? All right, we are kind of ready over here, silent, because I do not feel that energy that we possess over here every other day for all sorts of events. But uh, certainly, all the people who have come over here for Valorant, how many people over here have come for Valorant? Make some noise! And the BGM Islanders, make some noise! All right, I certainly think we do have more BGM Islanders as we have 24 teams. to participate over here we have eight teams in valorant and the students have been coming all the way from north south west and the central division we are four divisions over here it's going to be a three day event extremely wonderful extremely exciting enigmatic and uh, very very wonderful as well i would even like to welcome mr sunny bandhakar sir who's the ceo of esi and pranav prabhu sir who's the coo of esi and kasub khare sir who is the marketing head of esi ladies and gentlemen can we have a huge round of applause for them and i would even like to welcome our pro vice chancellor lovely professional university dr laviraj gupta sir i would request you all to kindly give the loudest possible round of applause for our pro vice chancellor dr laviraj gupta sir and now moving forward with the particular event that we have for the particular event that we have overcome over here in Shantideh Mithila Auditorium it is certainly exciting extremely wonderful because we are going to have a very wonderful ceremony over here which is actually called as a lamp lightning ceremony so i would request our chief guest of the day madam rashmi mithil worthy pro chancellor uh pro vice chancellor lovely professional university dr laviraj gupta sir our uh, associate director department of sports lovely professional university dr v call sir our professor and senior dean head student welfare wing lovely professional university dr saurabh lakhan pal sir sunny bandarkar sir ceo of esi Prab pranav prabhu sir coo of esi and kasub ghare sir marketing head of esi to kindly come forward for the lap lighting ceremony as they are stepping forward for this very wonderful ceremony you know what you have to do crowd do not disappoint them do not disappoint him do not disappoint me over here so give the loudest possible round of applause
Ladies and gentlemen, can we have a huge round of applause for all the dignitaries that we have on the stage of Shanti Dev Mitla Auditorium? Certainly, this championship is going to be extremely wonderful because it's the biggest one that. Uh, India could have had till date. Once again, thanks to ESI for being the sponsors and lovely professional university for being the venue partners of National Esports Championship. Right, as the and now we are moving forward towards a very wonderful ceremony which is known as the bouquet ceremony. So, I would request the CEO ESI, Mr. Sunny Mandarkar, sir, to kindly present a bouquet and a token of appreciation to our worthy pro chancellor. Lovely professional university, Madam Rashmi Mittal. Now I would request Pranav Prabhu sir to kindly present a bouquet to our Pro Vice Chancellor Lovely Professor University Dr. Laviraj Gupta sir. Thank you so very much to all the dignitaries for coming over here, commandeering your precious time out for this very wonderful national um, E Sports Championship, and now I would request our professor and senior dean, head student welfare wing, lovely professional university, Dr. Saurabh Lakan Palser, to kindly address the crowd over here that we have in Shantide Mithila Auditorium. Ladies and gentlemen, as he is coming towards the apron of the stage, I want you all to kindly give the loudest possible round of applause for our professor and senior dean, head student welfare wing, lovely professional university, Dr. Saurabh Lakan Palser. Off to you, sir. Sunny ji for organizing this event at lovely professional university and extending all the support either it is logistics, team registrations and all this casting into the uh, world market where this e-sports competition is going to be positioned in next three days. I also welcome your team members, department of sports, all the external participants and my dear LPU students. 
a great welcome to this event where we are calling it as an e-sports championship a coming generation sport i always feel i always feel that you students when you were in 10th 11th and 12th used to play the games in your mobile right and when this mobile goes out and you started networking sports in the form that your four five group mates are playing from their home it was not only study from home it was also gaming from home and then there were a lot of teams were developing so i tried to understand about this and i came to know that the market of e sports are growing more than any other market in the world and the students from computer science engineering animation who actually developed the logic for this game who developed the animations for these games have lot of potential of working for the e sports not only as a player but as a professional to develop this profession into a more organized profession so other than animation and computer science engineering there is also a great demand of casters what we call it as commentator in a normal event but the casters are for e sports so students from languages especially from english are also having a lot of scope in this e sports game and other than this all students who are interested in their own youtube channels telecasting then their narrations and all those things also have a great potential associated with e sports other than players so my all best wishes to the players who will be participating in this 3 days time in this university championship for e sports and all those students who are going to inspire from here not only by visualizing the game but also thinking that how they are going to adopt it as a profession so best of luck to everybody thank you very much thank you so very much to our professor and senior dean head student will be having lovely professor the university dr sarv lakan pal so for addressing the crowd and now i would ladies and gentlemen students and educators faculties and players this is the shoutcaster for the event dev lama welcome in everyone for the first match to your left for the first match is going to be the first team lovely professional university defending for the first half and on the right is going to be mumbai university attacking for the first half on the map ice box right here and right now 30 seconds until the match begins both the teams are currently picking their players what character they will be choosing each and every single character has different sets of abilities and he's useful for different things so right now we do have multiple picks already coming in from that two sentinels followed by two attackers and maybe they're slightly trying to float over silver or neon uncertain and help you they've just got the first pick we will be seeing ko and viper on ice box that's a good pick over there followed by a jet a sage and finally a chamber there we have it at last blizz will also be spying himself on silver there we have it now but the teams now prepared first match is upon us Once again, a reminder: first half will be defending on map ice box by Team LPU, and for the first half, the attackers will be Mumbai University. The game mode is going to be spike. What that means is one team has to go to one of the two planting sites, plant the spike, and wait for it to explode. The opposing force have to stop this from happening. If the plant does take place, they have to get to it and defuse it as soon as possible. Here we are now. Players moving into position. We're looking at a five-man stack to bomb site A. Could be two people moving to B, but still uncertain of that.
We do have a little bit of technical difficulty from Teams LP's headphones, so that's going to be shorted out shortly. In the meanwhile, we can still have a good look on the map. It's a pretty big map. It's going to be Icebox. Now, when the Icebox first dropped out, players did not love it. I can sort of see why. It's a cold-hearted map with nothing to give for it. Nonetheless, players also did adapt, as everything does happen. Nature does take its course. On the defender side, it's going to be Team LP. One's going to be on side B. They have only one man over there. So they're hoping to put one on A, one on B, and the three players are going to be staying at mid in case the rotation does come around. They're going to be waiting for the call, and only then, and only then will they be moving swiftly to defend. For the time being, as soon as the difficulties are sorted out, we will begin. Meanwhile, we will also be having a good look at the weaponries. The only two buys coming around are going to be from Jet on Team LPU and good old Brock from Attackers. I do wonder why he's going with a Ghost. Ghost, while it is good for one tap, Hatshot lacks ammunition. Not a good sprint prey weapon. And we're in, boys. 30 seconds until the walls do come down. We are back in the action. Both the players are finally ready at last. All well, the players are focused. I must also let you guys know there is this form of a playstyle known as the flow. It's very important for any player in any video game to possess. It's when you're completely absorbed by the video game, and that's the flow. And seemingly every single one of these players is attached to the screen. They are in that mindset. First off, we do have coming in Sova from Blitz. There's the first shot coming in, and we do have the pressure. He has been spotted. First shot's coming from Jet. Sees the opponent, has to back out. Arthur, knowing full well that the opponents are going to be pushing this location. Make their best efforts. He takes the first shot. He's the first man to go down. Mumbai with the first engagement. First casualties. Being taken by LP, he knows a jet break through it. Force the opponent has to back out once again. No armor gets okay. another kill. Mumbai, one man down, bye bye. But he has been trade off as well. Two players down from Team LP. One from Mumbai. Regeneration will be halted for the time being. As Dark is gonna be taking here. The opponent's on the right flank. Flanks it out. Ball one. He's gonna get baby. He's been shot. He gets it. Last man standing. Last man standing from Team LP. He won't make it. First round will go to the Mumbai University. And there we have it. First round, of course, coming in blazing on bomb side B. And A perhaps that was perhaps I'm gonna say that was A. From Mumbai Sharks, that was the first round you can buy them. LP had a hard time defending it. Of course they saw the push coming in but couldn't do much about it. As for round two, we're gonna go in once again. This time things are gonna be a bit different. A bit more downhill for LP as we say. Mumbai Sharks have better weaponry. They won they won the first round, so their economy is looking pretty good. LP might save this. The opponent, there we have it. Brock is going up front, doesn't care about the fresh fire coming towards this location. Couldn't care less about it. There's a little slow coming in. Break through the slow. Backs out in time. It's gonna be out right. Holy You're fine. And there's the first blood from Team Mumbai. He's praying for more, but he doesn't get it. In the hand, the spark is like the First one, he's done his deed though. Spike planted. Spike planted at B. I said A though. It's gonna be A. It's taken down, Sanji! What are you doing? That's a headshot! Another one, he spots him again. He takes a sweet time, missing his shot, so not an issue. He will make it count! Two players against another two. 2 v 2 well HP is gonna be Sage, has no healing left. No charge. Wait for a few while. That's not the time you have, buddy. Clock's ticking. They're both low. 
reloading. Last player standing. Last man remaining. Jet, can you make it? Spike's right there though. Spike, he, wanted, he won't be making any more shocks. We'll go in round two again. Out of charges. Round three. Now we saw our LP losing for the first two rounds. Knowledge for them. Round three is where it changes, and let me tell you why. So far, they have been holding back, and I actually mean it. LP did not buy any weaponries deliberately. Because in third round, when all that interest comes in all together, it's time to spend it in the money. It's time to go shopping, my man. That's a good spot. You do see over here, the attackers are looking pretty bleak here. And as for LP, they've got four ARs and a sniper rifle. And that's gonna be a good advantage for them. The walks over here. Slowly teaching and working. As he does move towards bomb site. Hey, he has been spawned. That's gonna be Jet. First engagement seen again. Oh, he's seeing it through the wall. I'm trying to get the shot on him. There's the sign. Jet backs off. Once again, they're looking for the pressure. This first blood out is the first man to go down. Plan's gonna take place on bomb site A. Spike planted. Well aware of it. The entirety of Team view comes in to intercept. Hopefully defuse. Come in play. That time. And he's got a jet on the backstab. Let's get bro. Left dog has to take his left, his friend will take care of it. On the right flank, they can see him. He gets one. All of a sudden, you're not gonna make it though. Only two blades remaining. He gets down and the last man remaining. What we want. Not good enough though. Sage will make it. Ultimate Master 69 from Team Mumbai Sharks will clutch it out, saving so barely what they almost had. LB have been denied their comeback. And score will be going to 0 to 3. That's only been round 3 though. Plenty more to follow, but that does force LP at a bit of a depressive economical state, seeing how they cannot buy. They're gonna be stuck with pistols for now. Selector and do have a sword fight with a knife. I mean, you can succeed, but it's, it's, it's not a situation you wanna be in. Lana, the kitchen, slowly to the steps. Eagle Demon, chamber. Spot oh Jet. Oh, uh, he's gonna be in for a surprise. Spot the headshot! Let's get another one! Back on his time! Sparky won't make it! The trade-off has already begun! The backstaff. We only have two plays down from Team LP. Only three remain. Lana. There's just bound to be players coming on bomb side B. Goes on to it. Arthur's also been killed off screen. Only two players remain. Blaze goes for the plant. Lana knows it's gonna happen. Comes out of the spot, but gets taken out. And there we have it. Mumbai would also win round number four. Seems like they're wiping the floor with this one. Back into action. LB finally decides to spend what little money they have and salvage every little round they can get. Running zero to four, not looking too good for LP right now. They're already four rounds behind. They need a win and they need it yesterday. Isolate and exterminate. The plane drone. Bliss. This comes forward and Jet's already up in the first blood over here. Looking for another. Spot the big gets it over. That's a double! Bike down, attacker spawn. Two plays down. He knows there's a body for one on top. He sees him. That's a triple right in early! And a quadra! What are you doing away? One bullet in the chamber. Can he make it? Last man standing. None other than Sapu. Not much you can do with the MVP. He's gonna be dead so far. The crowd's gone wild. One minute, he's gotta get it, but he's hanging that location and then peek, oh he just spotted it! Body. Not so soon as he me, he lives, he lives to rotate. So slow, he's got anyone make it close, so close. It's the 4v1 though. Got the self control, he goes down first round for LPU! They have done it! First round in the bank! Score running 1 2 4. 
things are gonna come back soon, it seems. Both the Thai teams are, however, looking pretty good in economy. And Jet, oh, you keep rocking that operator, little buddy. Yeah, good with that one. You good on that one, buddy. Team Mumbai Sharks from Mumbai Universities are aware that the strategies are not completely foolproof. Jet, once again, he knows they're gonna be coming on this one. He goes up front. He has been spotted. He doesn't care about that. He's running back in just back in time. Likely takes no damage. Arthur again, first man to go down. Or Bricks already get a flesh wound. Still a boost rip. Inside Jet. Be dark. They're all moving down scarcely. Dark's already down though. He's going to main from LPU. Jet, he's back and he's looking for making another play. Oh, up, gets him, it's a headshot as he level available. Initiates. He's got that on the left. Bottom doesn't get standing. it, he's gonna double! That's gonna be Deagle Demon with a triple kill so far. Bottom has a cast to kill, Jet can't stop this man! Oh, and another one, that's, yeah, that's gonna be it! Teamwork! Range supreme from Mumbai Sharks knowingly. Mumbai Sharks blew near completely well that they couldn't stand a chance against that operating jet, so they pushed all together, strategized, and overcame that hill that they came across. Now, it must be stated, all's not lost. Who is one to buy? First team to reach 13 points wins. First team to reach 13. You want to play? Let's play. And another one from the defenders. That's a toxic sandcastle. Stay in here. You're going to be the constantly. That's not a place to Get out of my way. And there's also all coming in from the attackers. First man down. Toxins going up. That's toxic down. He's down already. They have the site to themselves. They've already initiated it. Loud on the they'll plant and they'll take all the aggression they can. Oh, we found it. Arthur defending. Oh, couldn't get the shot in. Oh, Arthur's dead. Plant also down though. Comes and he's dead as well. Oh, oh, he won't be making it either. Only one man remains gonna be Arthur on the backstab. Save it. Got it now. Down below. Gotta be careful on that shot. It doesn't get it. It's gonna be a team. Sharks. Blue from Mumbai. Total of 1 to 6. Oh, a timeout, it seems. LP calling in for a timeout, rightfully so. Jet, the captain from their squad, they had a good run, a really good run, but wasn't good enough. So far, we've seen LPU having a hard time defending. Mumbai University are pushing into locations when it's the most critical. Knowing full well that there's one man defender, let's push out here. Oh, there's four at, we will ignore it completely. 30 seconds. Twenty now. Timeouts out now. Decided to change the strategies. They're all holding B. They're all holding A as well. So they've decided to invest in defending A. But, well, that's when things change. You see, Mumbai Sharks do decide to go for B this time around. Knowing full well they're going to. <laughs> and this was blood from attackers. As Brock gets a first kill. And Deadly Demon with another one. 
Remain. Defend us, LBU. Three players remain. Team LBU. Make it two now. Last man standing. Get it, you'll see the last of his hopes and life. Wait a minute. Sanji is at the enemy's backside. Spike planted. Last player standing. Saving it, it seems. Sanji will not be taking the risk on this one. This is a pretty expensive weapon he's got over here. It holds sentimental value, so he's gonna save this one. And carry this weapon to the next round. Or so is the plan. As for Team Mumbai Sharks, Blue Power, but they are a hunting party. Slowly, surely checking. Trap destroyed. Alright, Sanji is, a villa, is aware of their presence, and so are Team Mumbai. He gets to his own though! Team Mumbai You took the round, I took the economy! That's gonna be enough for another eight, one or two ARs. The score is one to seven though. We're almost at half time. Shot and has to back out. It's gonna be Jet, the Guardian. Enemy kill. What's the Enemy remaining. Careful. Universities, Shaku got another win on them. Jet sold in this location. The best of his abilities. Gotta be careful. They could be anywhere. There we have it, they're coming in for the bush. One's already in, and Jet's gonna be the first player to go down. For you. Don't get in my way. I'm off off from. Knowing full well that this place has to be defended in places. This is all the way, and Bronze already gonna come here with a double kill on dark. One enemy remaining. One enemy remaining. Triple kill over here. Oh, this is only close location with the shotgun. Fuck him, but it's just the shotgun. Diamond is gonna go down. Score running one to nine. Another win for team Mumbai Sharks. Blue. Need a drop. Here. Jet. Medicate operator. Medicate sniper. Always holding this location. They haven't seen Enemy back. There's one blood roll from Jet. Spike down A. One and a headshot. Uh. One more. 
come back. I'm sure there's many from the attack goes. And the revival will also come in. Trying to make it. Live for this one. He also goes down. Jets coming in with the double. Last man standing. Standing ahead. He lives. He pushes. Winning for Team LPU. Last round before the switch. Twenty seconds. For the next one. A gift. This is the last round before Swan. Also, it's half time. To spend all or keep nothing at all. Last seconds taken care of. Blaze is really once again area. going for the same strategy, trying to take over bomb side A. They're all over here, all over the stakes over here. Pretty high. First match is pretty bad over here for Team Elview. They've got to pull their socks up and get it together now. Getting everything in position, trying their best to stop this inevitable push. They're in the site now. Almost down, but he's been shut down. Two v two now. Jet, seen you get out of my way. Can you do it again? Can you be the savior for this squad? Uh. Do an operator now. That's a pretty sleek in that right. Not too far. It's been detected. He's well, he gets the last man standing. That's Deagle Demon goes with a triple going nuclear right here. It's gonna be Deagle Demon from Team M. You starting blue. Out of charges. That works. Caution here. Five seconds for the next one. Round 13. Signs have been switched. LP will now be on the offensive. Maybe things will turn different. <laughs> Hopefully. Sanji's going to be taking charge over here. Takes it out. Has been spotted. Though Brock is aware of the enemy's position coming on over. <laughs> Boss Baldemar doesn't get it. Boss Baldemar's coming. There's going to be the trade off. However, Deagle Demon comes out unscathed. Will he get it? Another one. 34 HP. Looking pretty slick over here, boy. And he will go down to Arthur. Having none of that. 3v3. Careful. Out of it, another one. Only two players remain from Team Mumbai University. Help you on the and also gonna get out to gonna triple. It's gonna quarter. Won't make it. There's a trade off. Last man standing. Spikes already taking place. It's gonna defend it. And if they won't make it, that's gonna be an LPU. Haven't been able to defend it. But they got on the offense, and that's looking pretty good over there. Round 14 is now upon us. Scoreboard does show that team Mumbai are not having a good time with their economy. Money is not flowing in as expected for the second round. After half, Brock's going a bit too outwards over here on bomb side A. Slowly, both of these teams each other out on the squad side. Jet takes the old point. There's the shots coming. Brock forced the opponent to get the headshot and not in time. 5 HP. Backs out. Will he live? Apparently so. Yes, he will. Heal comes in for him as well. Out of Police charges. Is away of the enemy. He's holding this position. There. 
Jets also holding out for it. Brock stretching out a bit too much here, buddy. On the other hand, LP decides to take all the cards they've got and invest it on bombsite B instead. He spots him. Deagle Demon lets go if he can make it happen. Backs out rightfully so, doesn't want to be caught off guard. 30 seconds ah. left. Arthur's gone. And got on the kill. On Brock. That's 20 seconds remaining. They've got to get the plan down ASAP. Oh. Got a lot of time left. Two players remaining from the defenders. There's going to be Team Mumbai looking pretty bad over here. Have to get the plan in from Team LP. 10 seconds. seconds. They get the plan in in time as well now. Last player standing. There's one man down. Only one man remaining. LP's coming in upper. Deagle Demon hasn't seen him on side though. It's one versus four. The enemy could be anywhere. Deagle Demon. <laughs> looking out for it. That's one blood over here. As Lana will be the first one. To go down, Deagle Demon looking for another one. Trying to spot it. And he will not make it! As Sanji will come on the backstab! I'll take that, thank you very much, as they steal and loot his gops. LP looking to make a comeback over here. They are currently standing at 4 to 10. Seemingly, they might just make it. Five seconds, round 15. Five men stack. Looking like the entirety of LP is going to push up on bomb site B. Eagle Deep. That's a good location on him. He's got a pretty good angle. Could jump down and go for it, but he doesn't know if the enemy's over there. He's hearing a lot of footsteps. He holds, he waits, he waits. Slowly he sees him, he gets one and backs up completely. I'm not gonna be seeing you again. The one man down and he looking for another one. He's not going to be making it. Sanji will shut him down. But Lana has been taken out as well. Three players remain from LPU. And 50 seconds on the clock. They get the plant out. Bombsite A is empty and ready for the taking. But they're not aware of it. Revealing area. Toxin screen down. They're holding on to this position. Knowing full well that if the enemy dares rotate. They will take this side completely. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds on the clock. Tries his luck and pushes it actually. <gasps> and through the smoke, what was that shot? Last Two players remain, make it one now. Positive one and it's gonna be dark. Will he clutch it out? Only 50 seconds left on the clock though. Plan of ammunition and armor. No toxins. Toxin screen down. 10 seconds, he has to get the plant in. Won't make it in time, Diane. He will not be making it. It's gonna be a GG's. 4 to 11. Mumbai Sharks Blue are in the lead. One more for match point and another one for victory. LP is having a hard time. I doubt they're gonna be making a comeback anytime soon, but just might. Hard to say we saw team. Bennett doing well. Maybe they'll also do and follow suit. Ten seconds until round 16 comes into being. You get that! Ult pops off from the de defenders. Oh, it's gonna be Deagle Demon and his ultimate weaponry, which is the echo of an AWP. High caliber sniper rifle. He's about to see the opponent any second now. Does he dare push? He does indeed. Spots one. Doesn't get it though. Backs up. Missed that shot. That's pretty crucial for him. Blinded. Jets gonna be taking her chances. Attempt to push. They're both dancing. Both the teams are currently dancing on bomb site A. Deagle Demon has a good view on it. One shot and they'll be dead. He missed that one. And he got it actually! He's the gonna be taking out Arthur. And there's a trade off! Jet gets a kill on Deagle! 4v4 now.
Brock with the kill on Jet. And another one, that's a double. 30 seconds left. One enemy remaining. Last man standing. Spike down. Oh, team Melview. They're out hunting him. He couldn't get the shots. That was pretty bad spread. They won't make it. That's going to be another victory for Team Mumbai University from Mumbai Sharks Blue. Match point. And we're at match point. LPU. I dare say this isn't looking too good for you. As for Mumbai University, all they need is one victory point to get this first match in the bag. We're at match point. And LPU is at a pretty huge disadvantage. There's a big gap. You want to play? Let's play. There we have it. It's begun now. Okay. All comes in from the attackers team this time around. From team over you. On the defense. Are going to be team Mumbai University. And I'll be only offensive. How they're still holding angles. Spot him! Couldn't get the shot in and Jet will be taking him out in a single headshot. Looking for more. Careful. Careful. Brock also gets a kill on lane. Spike down. Here. Attacker spawn. Brock on the backstab. He's <laughs> easy. Couldn't get shot. He has to be pretty careful on him then. This push is not going away. He has been taken out and Sanji will take care of him. All the time. down. Jet also down, they are going to make multiple trade-offs, 2v2 remaining, and he'll get it, Dark also go opening it out, last man standing, and he will be down as well, Sanji's going to close it out, score going 5-12. to 12. I hope you are back in the game, but... It's too early to say that. All Mumbai Shang Blue Rim requires right now is one round. That's all they need, just one victory. That's so lovely. They've got to drag this old hound all the way up. Ready. And they're coming in. Announcing the presence, but first match to go out is going to be Jet. That's a prime flag for them. They get a shot in, apparently not. Sanji's taking a lot of damage. Going to get the kill on that one. Bad trade up, the shot. He's going to triple. Blaze was forced to the kill. A evolving headshot on that one. What? And that's going to be it. Mumbai University, Mumbai Sharks Blue will take the first round. The first match is theirs. This is, however, a best of three, so that means LP still has the opportunity to turn this around. We'll see you soon in five minutes to so take a breather as both the teams try to change for the next match. See you soon. Check. Check. Check this. Alright, here you go then. We have the first map that has come to an end here. Remember, we're still looking at map number two and map number three. So for all of you seated here, do not go away. We're going to begin in a span of 10 minutes. And before that, we're also going to begin with the opening ceremony for a BGMI. So we're just getting a confirmation. Just give us about one minute and we're going to quickly start off with BGMI. Do we still have BGMI fans in the house here? All right, that's very good. Let me tell you, you can continue to support your teams as well. Just give us about two minutes. We're getting a final confirmation for all the teams, BGMI teams that are here in the house. What I'm going to do is call out your names. I would want you to come from the right hand side of the stage right here. You will have one volunteer with you and then you move out here from the left hand side of the stage. All right, so that's how the process is going to go in. We're just going to wait for about two minutes. Check. 
Do we have St. Wilfred University in the house? Pitching for St. Wilfred University? All right, we're going to wait then for about two to three minutes once we have the BGMI teams as well. Like you can see on the stage, the LPO Tigers are kind of strategizing and we want to try and see if they can come back into this game here in the second map. And uh, meanwhile, we'll still wait for our organizers to set up the BGMI teams and we'll introduce them very quickly. So for all of you seated here, do not go away. Stay put on your seats. And we're going to begin right away in about two to three minutes. Check this. All right, so for all of you who are seated in the house, I've got in some exciting news. Just got a final confirmation that we're going to be streaming the BGMI games here itself right after this game. Can we have some noise for BGMI? A little louder, come on. Can we have some more noise for BGMI? All right, so once, once the two...
players can come back into this game is going to be a roller coaster for all of us. So I'm going to head out from here and we'll leave the stage to the LPU Tigers and the Mumbai Sharks. You can stay put to your seats. Remember right after this, we are also going to live stream the BGMI game. So please don't go away. Thank you. back and we're back at it for game two on haven left side once again gonna be lp on the attacking this time though so for the first half defense on map haven is going to be by lpu defense on mumbai and attacking is going to be lp for the first half on Haven, lineup looking pretty sleek over here. We're looking at a few controversial picks. I have little faith in seeing a neon, and there we have it. They do switch it out for a Reyna or a raise. Both the teams currently selecting the lineup. Now, LP did not have a good time, to say the least, in the last match. Had a hard time carrying their match. Forward, just barely. A woman will be picked up for attacking. Choose your agent. All right, seemingly Team LPU is going to go all in on this one. They're trying to get the most out of the first half of the match. Whereas Team Mumbai, who are on the defense, are going to be playing the long game. An attempt to win by offense. There we have it, first round. And seconds until the first round comes into being. LPU is currently trying their best. That's not good enough, though, is it? We'll see with time. Looking for, for a five man stack on bomb site. Hey, this map is pretty big to say the least. Three sides, size. not one, not two, but three of them. Brock's gonna be the only one on long. I just call it a spot. Deponent also be there. Frenzy. Get a shot in. Just a mere flesh wound. Shit goes on defensive. There's the house spotted. Taken care of. Knows there's a reload occurring. And he pushes it, and that's the headshot instantly! And a double! One HP clutch! Down a. It's still not good enough, though. It's still not enough! Lana shut him down. 2v2. LPU is on offensive still yet. Oh, the spike. They need the spike. They can't rotate. The bomb's right there. They gotta come pick it up. Last player standing. Last minute, the backsteps come in, and he will not take it so slowly as we will have the first round of Team LPU. First round going to Team LPU as they deserve. Most definitely deserve. Second round should also be following suit. It's a easy uphill from here. Seemingly they have asked for a pause. And Team LBU has asked for their first technical pause now, which is completely sorted out and will be continuing as stated.
seconds. Make it 15 now until these walls come down and the laws of these lands will no longer bind these players. 5v5, 10 seconds until it begins. 5 men sank this time moving to bomb side C. Could go for rotation. 5 seconds until these walls come tumbling down. 3, 2, 1, and we are up. Eagle Demon's going to it's not something you want to see. Garage, but he's going to make it. He's going to do it. Oh, he's backing up. A three man push inside on bomb site C. And there we have it. False to Bloods coming from Sanju. A dribble. Three men down already from the defense. Elbius back in the game. Spike planted. Two players remaining. Defenders, they're going to be blinded. They don't take care of God. Chase has been spotted. He doesn't oh, care remember. about that at all. He will shut him down. And another one's fallen soon. Boss comes in, but he won't make it. Lana will take care of Brock. That's helping you with a double. Two victories in a row and third shit fall suit. However, we saw this last time and we will see it again. And the third round is where the tides shift. Third round. LP is now out weaponed, outgunned. Seemingly how Mumbai Sharks Blue has better weapons right now. They Take flight. They come to LPU the other way around. Just Out of charge. The home team. Jets gonna hold long. They've all been spotted. So they push now to be oh, just out of space. Lana doesn't get it. He's already got the first blood on Ultimate Master. With one kill and they're all running all the way back. All the way to the other side. Heels come in on mid rotation. Jet. Knowing full well that there's bound to be a player in it. doesn't care of it. Draws up just so I. And he will look at it in the eye and say, You're not killing me today. I will be taking your life instead as he shuts him out. Deagle Demon's one man. Army <gasps> doesn't make it. He's out. It's 2v2. Could go either way. Back one enemy remaining. Look at it. One man remaining from attack. Is it going to be Team LB? He has a spike on it himself. Arthur tries to go for the plant. There's one up front and one. 30 seconds right. left. On his back, couldn't get it, and it's gonna be fast victory for Team Mumbai. This goes running one two. LP is the lead with one extra point. Both the teams seemingly having enough money to afford themselves better weapons. Round four, LPU, on defense still have better weaponry this time around. S let's see how this will turn out. Couldn't find it. Couldn't get the shots and Jets already on defensive, he's got one! Looks like you want to fall though. Already in. Psycho, but fogging for an ad, he will not be making that cut! But Sanji on the end, he will! Ready, Eagle Demon. It's been taken care of, and Lana, there's one daddy. You did not see him though, and he will be traded. Last man remaining. Rock. Still remaining safe. Last taking place though. He's coming up behind them. He has the advantage here, they both think he's at the garage, but little does he know, he doesn't make it, Arthur will make it! He's been dragged down, score going 1, 2, 3, Elbius in the lead now! <laughs> and the T-Hack, the disrespect. Let me do a little trolling, a little bit of tilting here and there.
Seems like LP is having a better time attacking than defending. Which was offense for the first time from this one. So And there's the ultimate! He hits him once! He doesn't hit him second time, maybe third! Oh no, just Billy! 20 HP! He will survive! To live and tell him, but he will survive the offense! He will definitely go down! Caution here! Corner. Caution here! Oh, he knows! Lana knows! He's already pointed out to his ally! He doubts that there's someone there, and he would be right, but could confirm the suspicions. It won't be known until he pushes. He does it, and he pauses him, doesn't get it in time! Standing ahead. Bit too late on him, Ultimate Master survives at 9 HP. He still wanted to go for the push. Last Boss man, he won't make it! Last man standing! Brock! Pushing mid. He's been spotted, oh dearie darling! We're coming after you. 30 seconds left. That's four man. I can swan. On the back side, he's bringing his knife out. Pardon me! Do you have time to talk about it? Apparently not. Brock will not be taken out up here. His jet will be eliminated. No knives over here. You've got a knife to a gunfight. Sanji has a good position over here. Knowing that the opponent will be approaching from his forefront. He's left it out. Oh, has spotted him. They know his position now. Coming up on him. Backs out blinded. Block. Almost gets it, but barely! LPU's taking the lead again! Score going 1 to 4! Standing ahead. Revealing area. Out of charges. Spike down A. I have the spike. And there we have it. First blood already come in. Help you. They already went man down. Okay. And it hasn't even been 10 seconds until we've been done. Also, another couldn't get shot in jets. Take him out. Hatcher on that one. Minimal damage. He'll he has blinded and such a guy. Here comes the ultimate for a moment. Spotted and he won't be pushing up, but not for long. Demon will shut down Lana. Going back to sign people, he is safer. Who? The Jets has been traded out though. Two blizzarding from here. And three from Mumbai University Sharks Blue. They have the advantage over here. They could easily push and take this lead. However, it's a pretty risky move. Dark doesn't take the ult orb over there. Not to give away his position. Will be coming up against the opponent. But it gets shot in. As Deagle even 30 will seconds shut left. It down. I'm too far. I'm too far. I'm too far. In the garage, you're going to be Sandy with the spike. 1v3. Could he clutch it? He's eyeing bombsite B right now. And there's 15 seconds left on the clock. He has to get this plant down. 10 seconds left. He's been spotted. He won't make it. Brock will kill him out for this one. Not too far apart. Scores going too low. We're seeing a good amount of weaponry being flowed in for the defenders, seemingly how they're winning constantly. As for the attackers, Steam LP is not looking too good on the economy side. And Here. suddenly another match pause, apparently.
And we had a good time running in for the first half. But it's too soon to say that as of yet, since Mumbai Sharks Blue are also taking the lead slowly, creeping their way up. At the moment, strategy is what reigns supreme. We've seen time and time again that individual play give, will get you so far. It's a team effort which counts. From team LPU, we do have the two prime targets looking at Sanji and Lana. The top fragger is going to be, of course, Sanji from the entire game. Currently standing at seven kills. Rest of his team is going to be following suit. With Lana, Dark and Jet at 5 and Arthur following up with 3. As for the opposing team, they've got 2 top fraggers followed by 3 supporters. And that is all that has mattered so far. LPU is depending on individual plays, whereas Team Mumbai is more of a supportive kind. They're trying to distribute all these responsibilities they can afford to take up. On the other side, there are still four ultimates available for the defenders. It's going to be, of course, Team Mumbai, Sharks, Blue. Game changing us, then again, they're on the defensive. On the offensive, three available for Team LPU. We do have confirmation. It seems we have a bit of a technical problem on the back end from one of the Remember, it looks very interesting at the minute. So, once the technical glitch is sorted out, we're going to begin in a span of two to three minutes. So, stay tuned or let's stay here itself and uh, very quickly we'll get back into the game. Darko, 
Corner.
to play let's play guys the technical issue has been resolved and now we are continuing with the game again spike down i got it already on a triple down one enemy remaining we're making us be using mumbai once again taking the lead over here going 3 to 4 LP's forefront with only one point if they wish to remain on the top, they gotta get it together. Round eight. because they are bringing them back through the smoke enemy marks doesn't get shot in Brock just failure on back comes with the ultimate again one headshot looking for another spike down A so I'm gonna get shot tonight and he will be taken out by Sanji straight off for it with their operator now no one's been seen yet so much but guess one is killed. Through fire and smoke, he will find his target. Only two players alive though. They've got to take them three. 
Oh, it pops up. And there's the old man. I don't think he can survive this one. Just really, but they will make it. A triple. One ultimate to rule them all out. Sub noob. We'll close that round with an ultimate. Score completely evened out now. Thanks. Maybe the drop shots are at the lead by, by one game. And LPU needs this win desperately. They're both on equal footing right now. The skills are there on both squads, but the teamwork, that's where it seems, seems to be lacking. Revealing area. Okay, Master pops out his scouting devices. Cracker doesn't find anyone, neither does his drone. Shadows traveling. Shadows are looking for a quick peek of it. Really, Blaze also runs forefront. Okay. Don't see anyone. He Scouting does see them now. He's aware of the push coming on bomb site C. The information has been relayed to his allies as the defenders make a rotation. <laughs> Brock holding his eyes on long as the sole of I've got your trail. But they're moving to bomb site B instead. In garage. Blinded. 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 Already going down though. Then you want to follow to out. He's looking for more. I am the hunter. All pops off. He's gonna kill. Is that three? It's a triple. That's a good spot. Really pretty strong. Now. It's got three v two. Only two kills on life from Melby. They're on the offensive. I haven't been able to make a dent so far. Smart will come in on bomb site C instead. Like planted. Oh, we're gonna get a shot and Jet will shut him out though. You miss, I won't. Not spawned. There they are. He's now and he'll also go down. Triple looking for a quad. He will make it. He's gone nuclear. That's Team LB bringing it back. Score going 5 all right now. Need equipment. Five seconds, round number eleven is upon us. Half time in two rounds now. Standing Stop. ahead. Caution here. No solo, there's opponents approaching this location. Long's also not too far out. One place will be taken out from attackers. Nowhere to down. run! All pops in from the attacking Sova though. Right now. here. 
However, there's still four players alive from LPU. Straight it again. Yeah, Five of them. There's the fight coming in. Smoke's already located up. Down. Frozen concussion. And it's time to just slow them down. They use all the utilities on site A. Eh? And the mass exodus rotating to B. Perhaps even C from Garage. Blaze will have a good front view of it. C's one doesn't really get it though. Backs out. Wouldn't dare handle it. Bowman's going inside and he won't make another half with a double! And another one from Sanju! Only two players remaining, they've turned it back! Two players remain from the defenders. area. Mumbai finally having a bit of an issue. All is silent. The plant has already taken place. This just needs to blow. He makes his way to the side. Tries to go for a plant, but he gets it. And another one will follow them though. And Lord Marie will make it. And Lord has gone nuclear. LPU is now in the lead. Last round in the half. Last round before side switch. This is going to get tough. LPU has had a lot of issues in the first half already. In the second half, if their lineup does not match it, which unfortunately it does not, they're going to have a hard time pulling it up. They need to win this and defend for four straight rounds. Get out of my way! Spamming Zillamade, hoping to hit some targets. Caution, here. Oh, spotted him. He spotted three. He knows there's about to be a party coming in a way. Let's just throw it in real quick. Long. Lana, we know what she's good for. Lana's ah, already coming, pausing, and he has been concussion. Two men down, Bike three players ready for LPU, and already making it count. He's gonna be two players as Lana already goes for a double. That works. Get inside, gotta get the plant out. They are so dead. Here's his ultimate. Sees the corner peeking it. Blinded. Trap destroyed. I'm sorry, peeking out. Spotted gets one. Oh, and another one. That's a double. Almost a double. The son of a. And they've done it. LPU's in the lead. They've come back side. all the way, help is taking the lead now, but... And it's a big but. We've approached half time. Mumbai will be the one attacking and LPU will be defending. They haven't had a good time defending so far. Will they? Time to mobilize to my pack. Come on, LPU. You're already down low right now. On the offensive, Team Mumbai. Mumbai Sharks Blue. We're gonna push together. There's one down. Spike Looking down. for more. Get it. Trade comes in. More fire. Fire comes on ND. The offensive is already taken out too. Only two defenders remaining. The attack has a low HP though. Sanji's already taken him out. Only two players remain. Could push it. Oh, he's oh, signed up already. He gets rain. it. Last man remaining. They can go over the DVS. But he's going to backstab. Deacon's right behind him. He could make it big. He could make it happen though. They're on the One here. enemy remains. He's been seen. Oh, this guy, that's gonna be it. Defuse will come in. LPU will take it. It is over. 
Scott are going 5 to 8. Looking pretty good over here. First match after half time was taken by Team LP. They could, of course, hold up with another one since they do have the weapon advantage. Or save it Here's a smoke. Should start them for the push, but not this fish. Oh, they like it. He's simple and he just bats out in time. Lovely as he will survive to live another day and fight. Zanji is taking care of one. Four remain. There's the blind! Push comes in! He will not go down that easily! He's taking care of Arthur's already dead! Four your Deagle also gets out. Jet. And another one! Single time to head. That was crispy! Two players remaining from Team LP on the defense. 50 seconds on the clock. They have to defend it with their last lives. So he's playing a bit offensive. So he did not shoot them. He did not shoot them. He knows that they're coming in. He's really the information. They're aware of it, they all know it. Dark Fox 1. Goes for the shot, he gets one. Dying the munition. Solar couldn't get it! Last man standing. 30 seconds left. Sanji on Spike the back planted. time. His position no longer safe, but they're still behind him. Solar gets Captain one. Killed. Standing ahead. Two remain. Blinded. Knows another one. And another almost gets into the heart, gonna be enough! That's gonna be Team Mumbai. Take the win. LP had the economical advantage, but chose otherwise. That's gonna weigh down heavily on this round. As they will be outgunned, but not outmatched. By their opposing Eyes players. Up. One Five seconds left in the clock. Here. We have just begun. She's not been seen. One's gone Launching out. Smoke. They're coming from long. See, seems secure, and so is B. But A. Hey, Jet's right here. Jet's right on the corner. Jet's right around the corner. This is the camera, not for long, cross running, come in with his guns blazing. We've got two of them, and that's a swift victory for them. They have the sign, One enemy remaining. Place. last man standing, Brock on a, double, on a triple goal. Arthur's pretty laid back. He's dead now, Brock will close over the quadra. And that was Mumbai, bringing it back. A gift. On long dark. Shadows traveling. There's all the smoke. Those is about to be action. Hound comes in, he knows this coming! He's been blind, he couldn't see him, but the opponent does! They've Double been traded off! 4v4 now. There's the Asanji, couldn't hear us! Won't get it. Did a bit of a damage, but that will not be enough. Won't even close. Nana's here as well. Sanji gets one. Another. One enemy and remaining. And just one man remaining. 
It's gonna be the eagle. Someone has to sit on the DP, zones on it. They've got it. Questions will they be able to make it? The cocks will take it though. Just barely. They'll do it, they'll get it. There's gonna be another victory for LBU. Go oh, will remain seven to nine. And we have a match pause timer currently initiated as a member of Team Mumbai. Seems to have disconnected from the match. Pause timer has been disabled and continue we will be doing. Continue we will. Five seconds on the clock. Three, two, and one. And here we go. Sanji. In an attempt to find out the enemy's position. Push a bit too far. Back up in time as well. Five and push. They're completely going blind in here. Doesn't know if the enemy is coming in. He's already got fast blood over here. Rocks on a double. Planted. The Sentinel. Lana takes Haven from top side. His ally. And there's a blind out. Just keep not long. Too long though. The demon gets eliminated on his back. Hello there. A lot of jumps down to get the kill in. As Brock comes with a triple. Jets gonna decide to save it. Gets one. Team help you. They will not be getting this defuse. And Brock's coming right behind him. I don't believe they know each other. He has been hurt though. He will be seen as well and just gonna shut him down. Right before the round. And then he will take that kill. That soul's gonna be mine. Seconds until the next one. LP did lose that round, however. And it's looking pretty grim over here. It's a fierce competition, but they needed this in the first game. For second, a little too late, I suppose. Pause has been called up. Tactical timeout, if you will. Let's 
seemingly an error. Seems to be experiencing a network issue from Team Mumbai University. Mm -hmm. LVU is, of course, in a bit of a tight situation here. They can't afford to lose this game. If they do, they will be out. They will be out of the competition altogether. Mumbai on the other hand, Mumbai Sharks Blue. Simply gotta get this round. So while this technical difficulty takes over, we'll be right back. Now, despite the hiccups, we will be continuing as we do come around. You want now. to play? Let's oh, play. Top side. Jets coming. Holding angle, going to get the shot in. Close <laughs> call. Takes high ground. Go lock in that corner. Spotted and the Deagle with the better offer there. And another one. He has been blinded, and Lana will get him. Oh, the spot three opponent. Release information. Brock blocks it out. Spike planted. Spike A. Cover back to Ash of Jiren. Sanji is also been taken care of. Only two players remaining on the defenders. LV. Only two players live. Carefully take care of it as Brock also takes his die and Arthur will go down as well. There's going to be another round for Team Mumbai Sharks Blue. Goes nine all. Both the teams turning face to face now. LSP, however, has lost the first match, meaning they can't afford to lose this one. Well, my Sharks blue, however, could easily take this game and move on to the semi finale. 
granted if LP lets them, which is not going to be an easy feat. I've got your train. Lana sees the opponent. End of the shot, though. They found my trap. And a five and push on C. Take flight. Arthur. Seen the opponent, Arthur. Shift slokies. Dark, I didn't get a backstab here. Cover going out. This cover plants already taking place. They don't have a lot of time. They need to initiate. And they gotta go ASAP. Give me the back. And another. Time still taken though. They don't have any time at all. Last player standing. Last man standing is gonna be Jet. I doubt he'll make it. But he must. Almost I guess, but he won't. It's gonna be 10 9 and Mumbai Sharks Blue. Will take the lead now. Fifteen seconds for the next one. Ultimate is available for our good old Brimstone and Jet on the attacker. That's MU Sharks Blue with two ultimates available. And as for lovely professional university, their students LU Tigers. LU Tigers are lacking on their end. No ultimates, barely any That's amount of weaponry on them. Randall is still there. Blizz takes a charge. Third. The bird. To be eliminated. Shadow uh, lineup. With multiple people blinded. blinded. Arthur also blinds there, his opponent. Here. Oh, and he's already got him on the jets. Of course, he's here. Ah. One enemy Only remaining. One man remains. It's going to be Arthur. Heal up, boy. That's it, 11-9, Mumbai. Mumbai Sharks blue in the lead. And LQ is way back. We're gonna have a timeout, a tactical timeout. Coming in from the defenders, which is gonna be LP once again. They are down low and they are down bad right now. They cannot afford to lose a single round as we stand. If this goes to 12, if Mumbai University hits that number 12, if they win this, they are a victory assured. Because that way, the only way LP could win is by achieving an overtime, and that, as we all know, is damn near impossible. Performance-wise, they have improved, to say the least, comparatively from the first round. How that improvement is barely enough. Five seconds. Let's hope that this timeout will bring out the best out of our teams. Mumbai is already performing at peak. LP on the other hand, they've got to get it together. Twelve seconds. Ten now. Five seconds. Let's see what changes are coming to be. It. Did he mismeasure his backstab? Why did he not initiate? Why didn't he not initiate retreat? Could have easily taken the kill and gotten out, but I suppose he could have gone back that easily. Line in the backstab. see spikes here as well it's a 4v4 both teams know about the stake
Oh, Jet hasn't seen Here. them as of yet. He's heard them, though. He's heard them. And he does tell their location. 30 seconds left. It's going to be bombsite C, but it's completely open. No one's at C. Blinded. He's more than people and gets him, but he bonds out! Spike down, C. Jet on the back side, gets one. This one other won't be making it. 2v2, 10 seconds, they're just gonna stop the plant. It's coming in though. Left. Spike Good hit on him. Blinded. Enemy remaining. Also dead now. Close Last man here. standing. Barely any time left. Sanji, they're both very low. Takes out. Now they know his location. Yeah, two shots. It's a long plant. They could easily defend this. Sounds like barely any moments. Moments away from death. He's gonna check out long though, but that won't be enough time. There's no time left. He doesn't even get him. He won't be making it at the backside also. Secured. One enemy. Boss him, that's a kill, but it won't be enough. He's lost it. And that's going to be 12-9. Mumbai's stacking up the lead. Match point. But match point. One round away from victory is going to be Team Mumbai. They win this. They go to semi-finale. LPU, they've got to come a long way forward if they want to have any chance on this one. Money is also looking pretty bad for them. Forcing a buy. We see them using not their best weaponry. Half shields, a few shotguns, and whatever they can make do it. <laughs> so comes in. Kill point, they have five ultimates. They've got five ultimates on Team Mumbai Sharks. They just need this one little push. Just one push. And they will have the ticket to the semi finale. Currently, however, they're slowly creeping their I've way. I've got your trail. All comes in. All fun. You want to play? Let's play. We're out in there. The one part in the eagle will get the shot out. It's been planted. They have ultimate and everything. Unless they go for a backstab, LPU will not win this if they do not backstab and eliminate that trip zone. Oh, and there's, yeah, man, there's no way they're defeating this. And this is it. All comes as well. He's not gonna make it. This is it. GG's Bombay University have done it. LP will take the L on this one, though. That's gonna be Team Mumbai. LP had a good game going in the first one. Second one came close, but couldn't be making the cut. Once again, well played from both teams, but then again, the better player wins. So, see you for the next.
All right, next up then, our next university that we're going to call upon is... LPU Red Team! Our next team that's going to come up on stage here is going to be Sanskriti University. Can we hear a cheer for them as well? Sanskriti University. And from Sanskriti University, we have Aman Khan as the team captain, Shahzad Khan, Naveen Soni, Pranjal Sharma, and Mohammad Farooq. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the team. And like I said, there is one team that always gets the hoots here. And uh, that is none other than the next team that I'm going to call upon. It's going to be Team LPU Black. Can we hear a cheer for them as well? And from LPU Black, we have Chaitanya, Pranam as the team captain, Prabhupreet, Nayan Anand, and Shoranj. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the LPU Black team. next team that we are looking at is coming right from the capital. We are looking at Delhi University. Let's have a round of applause for Delhi University. And from Delhi University, we have Himadra as the team captain, 
Jatin, Yuvraj and Ankur Kumar. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the Delhi University team. Can we have the technical team here very quickly? Technical team. The next team that we're going to have on stage is New English and Junior College. Can we all round of applause for them? And from New English and JR College, we have Ketan, Piyush, and Avinash, Harshal. Guys, give, give a huge round of applause for the team. The next team that we're looking at is UCBHSH. Can we have that? Can we have them on stage? From UCMB, we have Hazik Irfan and Hamid Mozum and Naeem. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the UCMB team. Up next, we're looking at our next team that's going to be KES Shroff. Can we have them on stage? And like I said, let's continue to clap for them as they come up on stage for their team picture. And from the Keshrov College, we have Rohan, Shyam, Ganesh, Aman and Siddhant as the team players. Guys, can we appreciate their presence with a huge round of applause? Check our next team that we're looking at is AIET. Can we have the next team on stage? 
Audience, audience, you can continue to please clap and cheer for them. Remember, this is going to be a nutcracking encounter. And from Arya Institute of Engineering and Technology, we have Lal Chand Yogi as the team captain, Manish Rohit Sharma, and Lokendra as the team players. Guys, please appreciate their presence with a huge round of applause. Right after them, we have our next team. That's going to be Mumbai University. Can we have them on stage? And from Mumbai University, we have Sumuk as the team captain, Yash Sapra, Praveen Rathor, Ishan Shukla, and Harsh as the team players, respectively. Guys, please appreciate them with a huge round of applause. Be a good audience. Our next team then, right after them, is going to be APG AKT. Can we have the next team on stage? And from APG AKT University, we have Sai Sridhar as the team captain, Ken Joy George as the team player, and Renoy and Krishna Anuni as the team members. Guys, please give a huge round of applause for the team. After them, our next team that's going to come up on stage is going to be Islamic University. Can we have them? Lots of cheer for them. That's very good. And from the Islamic University of Science and Technology, we have Muhammad Hadi, Kaleem Ali, Basil, and Oiz. Guys, give a huge in the house. Come on, show your team some support. And from SP College, we have Fazil, Muhammad Sadiq, and Soeb, and Can we have them on stage? And from Ushodhya College, we have Muhammad Adib as the team captain, Pratik Nagar, Syed Fazil, and Muhammad Rihan as the team players. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the team. And remember, while you're looking at the teams, the live stream has already begun, as you can see there, and we are going to get that to you very soon. So stay tuned. Our next university that's going to come on stage is DIT University. The DIT Gildas, can we have you all on stage? And from the DIT University, we have Shiv as the team captain, Ayan, Dhruv and Dharam as the team players. Guys, please appreciate their presence with a huge round of applause. Our next team is going to come up on stage. We have the LPU Tigers. Can we all round of applause for them as well? 
and from LPU Tigers we have Juhi Sinha, Rudraksh Sharma, Sudeep Mukherjee as the team captain, B. Anand and Sukshan. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the LPU Tigers. Our next team is Chitkara University. Can we have you all on stage as well? And from Chitkara University, we have Aryan Sharma, Drajwal Ojha, Amandeep Singh, Jaskaran, Rishab Soni as the team player, and Jashan Jeet. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the Chitkara University. Our next team that we're going to have on stage is Santribal Phule Pune University. Can we have you all on stage? And from Savitri Bai, we have Pratamesh Pranav as the team captain, Yash, Swekar and Furka. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the Savitri Bai University. Our next team that we're going to have on stage is Desh Bhagat University. And from Desh Bhagat University, we have Vinayak, Ankit Shukla, Ashdip Saini as the team captain, Rajat Singh and Tohit. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the Desh Bhagat University. Remember, we have only last two universities remaining and right after that, you can check back on the screen that the live stream is going to begin. So stay here itself because the action is yet to come. And our next team that's going to come up on stage, we have Devikananda Global University. Can we have you on stage? And from Vivekananda Global University, we have Joel Philip James. Shailesh Sharma, Rohit as the team captain, Rakesh Kumar and Om Prakash. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the Vivekananda Global University. And our last and final team then is going to be JNTU Kakinara. Can we have you all on stage as well? Remember, there's always been support for JNTU and I'm sure they can do better. And from JNTU, we have T. Manikanta, Kiran, Sriram, Kumar and Ram. Guys, give a huge round of applause for the JNTU University. So for all of you BJMI fans in the house, just want to hear a quick shout out as to which team do you think is going to start off this map very well and maybe be in the top 4 or top 5. I can hear shouts for LPU. Anyone else? Hold a little on. louder, come a little louder. Hold on, hold on. LPU has got the 3 teams. LPU has got the 3 teams. Let's see which has got the maximum fan following. 
Black! For the black! Red! Tigers! Okay. Alright, so we're gonna begin streaming in a matter of few seconds. Stay put guys, if you have friends, you can make sure that you call them here because live action is going to begin right here for you very quickly. And in a matter of few seconds, like you can see, they're just getting set. And as soon as everything's set up there, we'll begin the live stream for you here itself. BGMI के लिए three cheers 